So here's day one on the horse arena project. It's going to be 200 by 120 riding arena with some horses. So somebody else had already done the clearing and the lady has to come in here and we're going to do all the, the grading and site work for it. Uh, level it out. we got about a three foot cut to do over there and push it over here and pack it in and roll that out. And we'll put in all the screenings and the railroad ties and make a border out of that. So it should be a fun little project. Should get all the dirt here moved in the next day or so. Here we are day three on the horse arena. About ready to put out the fabric. We got half of it graded out nice. The other half is still kind of rough graded. We had a about a two inch rain and this is the cut side so Obviously the ground was nice and hard here, but over there it's a little bit soft, so I got that broke up with the bucket teeth letting it air dry. Doesn't really dry much when it's 30 degrees and the wind blowing. But it'll kind of dry it a little bit. Uh, we got 24,000 square foot of fabric to put down. So let's, let's see, that's a little over half acre. What's the acre? 44,000 square foot? Yep. So a little over acre we got to completely cover and Put four inches of compacted screenings on top of that and then two inches of loose. So we're also going to surround it in railroad ties. So it's coming along pretty good. Bring another roll of fabric over here. <laughs> oh Lord. And uh, keep on rolling this out. Getting it covered before it rains again. So we've got all 24,000 square foot of fabric put out. Now we're going to start pushing these screens we stockpiled on this side over here and getting it graded out. We got like 500 tons. I'm going to put it in four inches thick and compact it. Then put another two, two and a half inches of loose on top. Well, here it is at the end. Uh, we've had a lot of rain since I finished it. So I just have finally got back out here to get the last piece of equipment. But there it is, a 24,000 square foot horse arena we built. She's already put her stuff in there. And we got a road that goes around it. Where I cut it down, I put a little ditch on the uphill side where the water can run around. I got a four inch crown in it from the center halfway to each side. So the water run off and we surrounded in surrounded it in old uh, railroad cross ties pounded them in the ground with rebar so they're not going to go anywhere but there it is all done <laughs>